What is up, MFers? Welcome to Tournament Morning. This is the third EQ of the year, and we are at Bugs Island, AKA Kerr Lake, on the border of Virginia and North Carolina. Man, it's been a different practice for me than the first two tournaments. You guys saw me doing the offshore scanning and everything at Eufaula, the first tournament, Toledo Bend. Uh, and we did a lot of that here too, but things have been extremely difficult. Uh, it's just become really evident to myself and I think a lot of guys in practice, but everyone that I've talked to, there's so many pound and a half to two and a quarter pound fish in this lake. And those are all the males. The, we, we're just gonna have to mix in some females and hopefully get lucky with a couple better bites because a three pound bite or a couple or a four pound bite is going to be absolutely huge and probably separate yourself. No joke, maybe a hundred places if you catch one four pounder to go along with those twos in this tournament. So a totally different event than the previous few. If you watch practice, we got two things going. We got a little in game, little out game. We got some, some hopefully some bluegill eaters that have moved in the back of pocket. The last two days, I burned an entire tank of gas pretty much in half of the day, two times. Once I started running around looking for this pattern, finding the right stuff on some of those hardwoods and the, the little V cuts on some of the shorter pockets. And then we also got some fish on stumps uh, in eight to 17, 16 feet of water. And that'll be drop shot fish, jerk bait fish, spinner bait fish. We're legit gonna try to hit 50, 75, maybe even 100 different spots today. Uh, so hopefully you can keep up with us. And coleslaw is actually going to be on the boat today. So that's gonna be different than the first two events too, because I do not have a co angler and I'm boat number four. Honestly, I don't even, I'm not even positive where I'm gonna start. I'm just gonna kind of send it so I wasn't like, I gotta have my boat as fast as possible so I can beat someone to a school of fish. No, I don't got a whole lot of that going on. There is no schools. We're just gonna run down to a productive area where we caught some keepers in practice, poke around up shallow, and then we'll freaking go from there. The whole name of the game is going to be get as many bites as possible for me and just see where that freaking gets us. Might get us seven pounds, might get us 15. I have no idea. But regardless, this one's gonna be a fun one. You're gonna see a whole lot of shallow cover, flipping, frogging, buzz baiting to go along with a lot of the offshore stuff we do. So uh, we're gonna get her launched here in about five minutes and uh, it's gonna be an interesting tournament. Hopefully not one that makes or breaks the year. We're just gonna try to get as many points and as many bites as possible. Let's get it. Three, two, one, we are officially underway. Looks like a spot of fish would live. They're not in top water. Not very smart, but I'll take it. Hopefully the old scale feels like being accurate. One sixty nine. We're on the board with a big. Well, that was the main goal in this tournament was just to cross the scales with something, you know. So I'm kidding. Let's start though. Long. 
looks like a damn spotted bass. Well, we're gonna stay flipping for a while. That deep stuff's a nightmare to fish. And I was sitting there staring at them and they still wouldn't bite, so must be a timing deal. Please stop, you little sucker. Thought he was bigger for a second. It's just mush and then he went straight sideways. Thought that was a fing stick. Giant. How is he so concave? It's just embarrassing. 138 mile That's better. That's better. Point bushes, Cole. Point bushes. Let's can go. Five of those. Giant. <laughs> Point bushes. So even two pounds. Two fifty one. Might as well be 10 pounds. There's something to that. That was a bush off the point. Haven't hardly been fishing those, but we got plenty of those to run. Another swim bait fish. Stopping? Might actually be a female too. Look like back at Nebraska. Summit Lake in 2006. Oh yeah, that's a big one. We'll double weigh him. 169. We got a limit for 892. I'm gonna keep that swim bait in my hand more, but man, I guess ones like this eat it even. You'd think that it'd be hard for something under two pounds to even get it. Get out of there. It's a 
better one. It's not a big one. No, it's not. Not better or big. Replace a pip squeak with a pip squeak. Two thirteen, two eighteen. Number three. Three is good. Four is good. One's good. Two is not good. God. What about five? So I got one more in here with no tag. And I need to see which one's which. I don't know how important every ounce is going to be in this tournament. Water drop with weight, everything. Yep, that's a small one. Whew. Huge coal. Almost a pound, actually. like somewhere a big one could live. Good one. About time, about time. I think there's gill beds right in there. Oh man, that's huge here, huge. Is that a three and a half? Not in a spot at all where, where a big one should be really. 317. Yep. Oh, that's a big coal. Oh man, two more like that, one more like that, really, we're gonna be in business for being on track at least, and we got a long time to do it. God, I wish I had more spots like this one. All my other stuff's kinda at the back of stuff, but I don't know if you guys can see this. See how light brown that is, it's because it's sandier. And so I guarantee what's going on is the bluegill are spawning in here, or around here, and it's got this isolated tree back here. It's kind of, I came back for the isolated tree and I caught that one off of right there. Whatever, I'll take it. 169s, it's two smallest ones, both 169 exactly. If I get those two out of there, whew, be huge. I got another one on. It's bad luck. Weird color little guy. Productive little spot here. Might be doing some more looking for spots here before too long. We got a lot more to hit though. We probably got 10 more spots. Man, that fish was in no water. Good. good job today, Jack. Good luck tomorrow. Ben Milliken, he held up the trophy at Toledo Ben went wire to wire. Five in the bag. Worth 11 pounds, seven ounces. Gonna jump you up to fourth place, so it's gonna be a good start. It's a little tough out there. Super tough out there.